Hello everybody and welcome to Brink. Uh, I actually got this game on Tuesday when it came out, but I haven't recorded anything yet because I actually haven't been having a very good time with it. Uh, I figured I paid for the game, might as well get some recording out of it and go through the quote-unquote campaign at least. So, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to start a totally new character here. Forty years Watch ago, we started building the Ark. Back then, it was an experiment. A dream, a self-sustaining city of the future. But then the seas rose. We were forced to relocate, but still our floating ark became a refuge for tens of thousands. To maintain order, the ark was divided. And now we're out of time. The Ark is wearing out. No new ship or plane has been seen in 20 years. The new guests live in slums. Disease, thirst. Some have formed a resistance that vows to seize power and search for life outside the Ark. Ark's security force says we must have order to survive. So will you save the Ark or escape it? Well, I think we're going to go with the resistance here first. To save our people, we must escape the Ark! Alright, there we go. So there's a couple of different modes. There's um, challenge modes and then quote-unquote campaign mode. The campaign mode is actually not much of a campaign at all. It's really just a series of uh, multiplayer maps. I think we're going to let this look. Uh, it's, it's, it's not the best. Sorry! Get friendly fire! He's got my face! Upgrade! I'm the heading to mine! Weapon! Chunda! Oh. Needed that! Locking out! Mine planted! That's oh, we'll me! That Enemy one. in disguise! And yes, for sure. Um Guess we can customize them a little bit here. See what we got available. Not very much. Most of this stuff is unlocked through playing challenges or un unlocking certain amounts of XP. You can really even bald. Hmm, whoa. Awesome, no thank you. I don't need facial hair. Yeah, it's all good. So most of this stuff is still locked. We'll have to deal with more of this later. We'll just we'll leave that for now. Okay, so let's just select character. Let's watch the introductory video. The Why not? The following briefing could save your life. You can play Brink in three ways. Campaign mode follows the story of the Civil War on the Ark. Free play allows you to play those missions in any order with custom settings. Challenges grant you the opportunity to hone your skills in specially designed scenarios. You'll earn experience points for your successes, such as completing objectives or assisting your teammates, which will raise your rank and unlock new outfits and abilities. New weapons and weapon attachments can only be unlocked by completing the challenges. To win, your team needs to complete objectives, and to do this, you need to be the right class at the right time. 
Soldiers can complete destruction objectives using explosive charges, replenish the ammunition supply of teammates, and throw molotovs. Operatives can plant computer hacking devices, disguise as falling enemies, and spot hidden enemy mines by iron sighting. Engineers can complete construction objectives, deploy mines, and buff teammates' weapon damage. They can also disarm mines, explosive charges, and hack devices. Medics can buff the health of teammates and dispense revive syringes to fallen comrades and mission VIPs. You can change class at any friendly command post. Command posts, when captured, also apply bonuses to your entire team. Your HUD will let you know when your team has captured command posts. The status of your team's primary objective is shown on the right in yellow, with active secondary tasks underneath in blue. View objectives by pressing and holding up to display the objective wheel. Make your choice and release up to set it as your active objective highlighting it in the world. Once you reach it, you'll have to interact with it for several seconds to complete the objective. The lower left shows the special abilities of your character, as well as your supply meter. You can equip an ability by pressing the corresponding direction. Using an ability will spend one pip of your supply meter. The meter slowly replenishes when not in use. Your current class and health are displayed in the upper left corner. Health will regenerate if you can escape danger. If you lose all your health, you will be incapacitated. You can choose to wait for a medic or redeploy when the timer reaches zero. Medics throw revive syringes, which you can use to get back up. The Ark is a dangerous place, so be sure to move more than you shoot. Always stay close to your teammates and play the challenges to hone your skills and unlock powerful weapons. More detailed instructional videos can be found in the dossier on the main menu. Follow these guidelines, and you can win the war. Alright, so I, I did go through a couple of the challenges on my own, and I gotta tell you, if you're gonna buy this game, whatever you do, play it online. They say there's a single player, the bots are so terrible that it's almost impossible to complete some of that stuff because they won't cover you while you're trying to set up charge or whatever, and they won't set the charge, so you've gotta do it, and you got no coverage while you're trying to do it.